Well, hello and welcome. So I am Nate. We are next to a busy road. The wind's starting to pick up. It's loud. I'm not even sure if you can hear anything I'm saying. Now this is the Blue Ridge at Centennial Homes. So I'm just going to cut to music, be real quick, I'll tell you about it on the inside. Now that we're inside, we do have this really nice coat closet right when you walk in. As I was trying to say, between all the noise and the traffic and the wind, we are at Centennial Homes, just south of Rapid City, South Dakota. I want to say thank you for letting me come to film the homes. This is a three bedroom, two bath home, 1,660 square foot home. This is called the Blue Ridge. And I really like this tray ceiling up here. I've noticed that they've all gone with this uh, tray ceiling and the beams across there. It looks really good. So you've got this really big living room area here. I really like this entertainment center they went with. So I really like the outline that they used here, this glass outline on the electric fireplace. You've got, once again, this really nice entertainment center here. Built-in HDMI cable. Comes out right back there. So really nice, well thought out. We're gonna come, well, let's do the kitchen. We're already facing this way. Stainless steel Whirlpool appliances. Really nice island here. I like the way you've got it set up. You got seating for two. Plenty of room to lay everything out. You know, while you're prepping your food or serving while you're entertaining, that kind of stuff. You got great big pots and pans drawers. Now they went with a different color for the cabinetry here than they did the rest of the kitchen. The rest of the kitchen they went with the dark gray cabinets. They are fully adjustable shelves, soft closed doors. Your microwave is uh, built in, not above the stove obviously. You got drawers going above all your doors. A nice stack of drawers over here for all your utensils and things. And I really like this glass backsplash I used. Looks really good. All the way to the ceiling. And I love these glass top hoods.
And there's that great big window we were looking at as we were walking around the outside. Nice big farmhouse sink. Again, they got that Springer faucet, so to say. And your dining room, as you can see, you got plenty of room for the table they got there. We could even add a larger table if you needed to. Sliding glass doors. Once again, they went with the recessed lighting above the table giving you that much more space above, makes it feel much more open. Check out the kids rooms are all down at this end. First off, we gotta check out the bathroom. Now they did give you a little more counter space in this one than I've seen in some of the others. So it's nice to see that you've actually got a little counter space. Really nice light fixtures up there. And I love that they've all got these transom windows above them with the one piece shower tub combo. And the bathroom isn't as narrow as some of them. It's a little bit wider. So it's a nice feel when you walk in. Got a linen closet just out to the left of your bathroom. And your bedrooms are really nice sized bedrooms. There again, they went with the double uh, rack, so you're in your closet area. Now both bedrooms feel to be about the same size. I guess I'll know once I get the floor plans if they are <clears throat> if they are or not. And in your utility room, we've got your back door. coat locker there, shoe storage down below, place to set your, your bags or whatever when you're walking in. Nice to see they've got a sink, some nice cabinets up above you. You got your furnace, your water heater, and a really small coat closet here. It's got to be one of the narrowest doors I've seen. but you have a coat closet in your utility room. It's functional. Let's go check out the bedroom. Well, we'd already looked at two of them. We gotta go look at the master bedroom. So master bedroom, nice big long transom window up above your bed, got this great big tray ceiling up there, so again you've got that stainless steel fan. In your closet, 
Now it's already on because I did a walkthrough here, but it does have an auto on feature. So as soon as you walk in here, the light will come on automatically. Or in this case, when I opened the door, it came on automatically. You've got the double racks here. Nice built in right here for your linens or whatever else you want to store. And then down at that end, you've got the single rack. And your bathroom. We've got this really nice set of cabinets with a whole stack of drawers. Once again, you got that nice little center stack there. There we go. Hello, Raiden. Now you can see me. I do like these square porcelain sinks. We've got the freestanding tub here. Now it is a good sized tub and it's fairly deep. Great big transom window up above you there. We've got a nice set of linen cabinets here. And then we've got the really nice, really large glass inlaid tile shower. And I've still been trying to figure out what these are used for in your shower. So if anybody knows what you would use those for, let me know. No, I've been trying to figure out what you would need those in your shower for. But I like the color of tile that they used in here. It's really nice. And this has got that extra tall piece of glass that goes almost to the ceiling. So really nice shower here. So with that, you should go down there and leave me a really tall comment. What did you like? I really like the colors they used in here also, by the way. What do you think of the home? I really like the entertainment center there. Do you like the way they got it set up? Don't forget to hit the like button. Don't forget to, yeah, so don't forget to hit the like button. Don't forget to turn on the notifications after you hit the subscribe button. That way you get notified when I upload videos. I do upload it three times a week, every Sunday, Wednesday, and Friday. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.